Okay, so hi everyone. So I'm doing my update and I tried to rush to a crystal shop, which totally wasn't planned. And if you know me, I don't like last minute plans. But I'm going to um, just gonna quickly review my vinyl update. Gonna do reviews shortly. Also, who's gonna watch the last Sharknado on the whole channel in the UK? I am. It's gonna be so bad. So let's start. So I'm gonna do a reaction to my um the first time here you might have guessed already from the clue maybe if you only um probably you won't also remember to like subscribe sh turn the notification bell share and leave an album you think i should get on vinyl in the comments okay so here it is so i'm gonna do my opinion. oh this is interesting this is interesting oh my goodness it makes me do <laughs> okay yeah so I got Led Zeppelin 2. Um, yeah. So good. Yeah, so very classic album. Like personally I so this is part of another final subscription called Stylus and um, yeah this is I was so surprised when I got this. So basically I have a theme every month. This this month's theme is about freedom album, you know, after the entire lockdown. <laughs> so yeah. But the last thing was second out and obviously that said to add it's Led Zeppelin 2 so of course it is. So yeah. Yeah, so that's it. So that's the um what's it called again? I don't I don't know the name, but it's kind of it was it was kind of uh, it was kind of on the first Led Zeppelin cover. If you're watching and you're a fan, let me know what it's called again. Yeah. So yeah, and you have the four members. Does anyone actually notice that three or four Led Zeppelin members have J in their name? And two of them are in fact called John? That, that surprised me. Okay, so you have... Okay, and I've not really heard of these songs. Like, I've only... Uh, the only song I know the name of before getting this was... Of course, Stay Away to Heaven. And, yeah, I'm not going to show you the vinyls today. But, yeah. The next one is Talking Heads. More songs about building and food. What a real title. And um, the back is um, you, the United States. I, 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 but they're, I think they're from Scotland. They're not, they're not from the United States. And just that there, I need to show you the inner sleep. That definitely wasn't really important. So, amazingly, if I show you on no, Wednesday, a week ago, but I had to go, however, we first went on Friday. I mean, the record shop I went to the opened. Um, it's um a pop. I'm not going to tell you which but so it's Bob Dylan's Rough and Rowdy Ways, and it's very new. But I know you're saying no, it isn't. I got the CD. My my because a lot of the viewers are kids. My parents got that CD in the near the 29th. That's where it came out, and no, we didn't. Yeah, I mean it did, but the vinyl was released until the August. So yeah. And you have Rough and Rowdy Ways, and at the back, the most famous single from it, Murder Most Found, and then we have the inside, you know, we have most of the songs, like, I remember getting the CD from my grandpa, and I would, so just so I know, side one, two, and three are one, but the other is Murder Most Fall. Let me explain why that's one, and why I actually gets the treatment on the CD to be one of its own. It's because it's 16 minutes, you only at 56 seconds, nearly 17 minutes, meaning that it's the longest Bob Dylan song. And yeah, so I'm just gonna get these up. So this is the other single, False Prophet. And um, the other thing after that, I could take much. I could take more too. So I think that's probably not the best round. So this is a bonus one. So. Oh, <laughs> yes, this happens sometimes. <laughs> okay, anyway, just like deal with that later. But like John F. Kennedy. Um The Creators Kill to Revival featuring John Fortune Chronological, the Crane's Greatest. And this is second half. So basically my father is a doctor. Um and basically his um I forgot the name, like a colleague. Basically, um so basically the mother I don't really want to tell the story, but basically the, they'll give you know their finals, so Basically, she picks up this one, so yeah, and um, it's from, it's a UK edition, from, 
Williams made uh, on release in 1976. I think this one is. And um, yeah. Also, there was Beatles song, which you know I'm a big fan. But her brother just literally took all of it. <laughs> like, like it might, you know, like it makes sense. Why do I need so many Beatles? But um, yeah, that that, that was good. So yeah. Also, um, I'm becoming a bit. Uh, now I'm not gonna show you my comics. So I'm gonna quickly show my the Blu-ray I got. Like we not we got DVDs, but I wanted to make the switch to Blu-ray <laughs> because I wanna get a lot of movies. Finally. My first, and it's not really a classic. The next really classic I want to get is I want to be older because of Netflix and things like that. But it's the Batman uh, motion picture anthology in here. I'm a yeah, and it includes Batman and Batman Returns and Watcher Two and Batman Forever. Don't know about really what happens in that one, but oh god, Batman and Robin. I haven't seen that one, but it's gonna be bad. Just like the last Sharknado, I'm gonna leave a link down below to the trailer. I, I mean, two trailers, and one of them is definitely not a Rick one. Um, it also so it also includes 18 hours of musty profiles, documentary making of features, and nine music videos, including Prince's awful back dance. Yeah, that's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. Now. And also I'm saying, oh, what's your age? Well, you can guess, but I'm definitely not 50 by that by my voice. So you say, why are you watching a 15? Well, I'm allowed to. So remember to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell, and leave a comment. Uh, okay, leave a comment of an album you think I should get and share. Bye.